Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Today is the last day before the big uh, national holiday here in China. Uh, again, today I was actually, I thought, today is going to be a boring day, not interesting for you guys at all, so maybe I just shouldn't um, vlog, but, you know, then some things happened and, it happened and I thought, hmm, they would like to see that. <laughs> or maybe it's more Ling Ling wants to show that, you know. Anyway, I just had a shower. It's uh, 11.30 a.m. and they're building outside still. I'm just going to show you guys. I don't know what is up with these people. Sorry, you can see me as well. I don't know what's up with these workers, but basically they work um, from the morning, from 7 to 9. Then they have a small break. Then they work again now. Then they have a break all afternoon and then they don't start working before like 9 in the night. Guys, if anyone knows why, then please let me know. Because me and Jasmine here in the, this room are not excited about it. Like, it's so, so noisy in the evening, so noisy in the morning. And I'm just like, why wouldn't you work in the daytime? Like, there aren't even people walking around here in the daytime because people are in the offices and there are not that many people here anyway. So, I don't know. Just uh, let me know if you guys know because I really want to know what they know that I don't know. Well, because yesterday was so busy, today I am just watching a Danish TV show because the internet is actually working. And I also just received a QuaiD and that's what I wanted to show you guys. If you don't know, QuaiD is, um, you know, the mailman who comes here. I still didn't check up on what you would call it in English, but basically it's just a guy coming with packages. You can probably still see him downstairs. Yeah, like the... Can you see him though? I think the shadow is a little... There you go. Uh, this one here. This one is Quidi from uh, uh, from one uh, sh shop called T-Mall. Yeah, anyway. So he's calling me. Hello, hello, your Quidi has arrived. And I say, okay, two seconds. And then I run down. Thank God, I had just showered and I had just put on my clothes and then he called me. It would have been really awkward if I had to run from the shower because they don't wait too long. Anyway, I want to show you guys what is inside this package because I've been so excited for it to arrive. I should start doing like monthly favorites and this one would be like a monthly favorite every single month. Anyway. I should first try to find a place to put the camera so you guys can see something and I can open my uh, package. Hmm, good question. I need to get my um, tripod. I need to find that one again. I actually didn't use it for quite a while. By the way, sorry guys for all the mess here. Like we are both very messy in this room. Oh, panties. Oh, I really need to figure out where to hide my panties so you guys don't have to bump into them all the time. It's really awkward. Anyway, there we go. Um, this one is my roomie's table. This one is mine. But because I have this one, so it kind of hides the light, which is really annoying. So I'm just filming from her side, so it's easy for you guys to see. And yes, a few days ago, we have a roomie, another roomie, who doesn't... I don't understand it, but she doesn't like sweet things. <laughs> so she gave... she had just gotten the Nutella, and then because she doesn't like sweet things. What's up? Like, why would you not like sweet things? I don't know. But she gave this to us, and now we're, like, sharing it, putting it on the crackers. I'm probably going to have one very soon. Mm, amazing. Amazing. But anyway, tripod and I should get started. And I think we got it now. I hope you guys can see what's going on. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Ling Ling is so excited. La 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 la. So excited. Eeh. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I really hope you're in focus, I can't see it, but look here! Yeah. Ah! This is, uh, it's German candy, but it's like Ritz licorice. Gantau in Chinese. Gantau Tang. Um, here on the back it says Haribo Gantau Wei. So, yeah, licorice. 
I bought two because I couldn't help myself and I'm so excited. <laughs> you saw it in uh, one of the previous videos that I had to, that I bought this one as well. I ate it and I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. Okay, I'm just going to see. Can you actually see me? <laughs> there we go. Hey, friends. <laughs> um, yeah. So I thought I should film my excitement. Yeah. Don't tell my mom that I'm eating licorice before noon. Amazing. This one is the sweet licorice though. <clears throat> I'm thinking about because on, on Taobao there are different kinds of licorice of course and they're selling they're selling um, some licorice from Scandinavia and <laughs> they advertise the licorice as the most difficult thing to eat. <laughs> so I don't know what you guys think about it, but I was thinking about buying some on Taobao and then invite my roomies for a video and then ask them to try it out. <laughs> to see the reactions. <laughs> I don't know what you guys think. Please let me know in the comments below if you would like to see that. Because <laughs> that could be hilarious for me too. <laughs> I tried it before. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> I'm a bad person. <laughs> I should eat some real food, but that was good. So that was the first thing. Then the second thing I was thinking about cutting my uh, fringe. Because you can see my fringe here is getting quite long. This? Just thinking about cutting it. And I thought, why not do it on camera? <laughs> because, you know, <laughs> because I'm a camera person. And I should document all the mistakes I make in my life, right? <laughs> Maybe I'll not do that another time. Anyway, I have this. And the scissor. So I'm just gonna wash the scissor and then and we should try. That's so typical. I thought I was I thought I that I was filming but I wasn't. So basically I just cut my fringe for a <laughs> for a turned off camera. Wow, great, okay, awesome. <clears throat> what I did was just I had the trash can here. And then, well, I can just check if I'm still missing something. So what I did was just to pull my hair down like this and then be like, oh, where is it too long, you know, and just like cut a little bit here. Just so that I can see again. And then I think in the end I said, why you want to... Pay money for that when you can just do it like this, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think it turned out fine. For now, anyway, you know. See you on the other side. I also need to, um, I need to dye my hair again because it looks like it's so blonde, grayish here, and like the color is really mm, sad. So I should do that one of these next few days, but anyway. Now I cut it. So that's the start. And I should get ready because I should go to school soon. Probably not going to bring the camera because I don't think anything interesting is going to go down at the campus. And I think we're going to a bar tonight. And yeah, I actually, oh, I wanted to go to the gym as well, but I don't think time is, I don't think I have enough time. So I might do that tomorrow morning. Yeah. And then we have the golden week in front of us and I wanted to go somewhere but the tickets were already sold out so I just was like whatever. Um, I'm probably gonna do some stuff here. I have some ideas I want to do anyway and uh, uh, I need a lot of time to do that so I'm probably gonna do that instead of and yeah now I'll turn on the air condition again because it's so boiling hot in here. I closed the window because the workers are being so noisy outside. And yeah, I'll see ya. Oh, 
Okay, guys, I just came back finally to my dorm room. I have like half an hour, so I thought I would just have a little chit chat gossiping with you guys. And uh, and my roomie is here as well. She's just trying licorice for the first time, <laughs> and she says she can't explain what the taste is feel is like, mm, right? Yum, yum. Yeah, no, but she's eating That's some. That's not of it. that bad, but <laughs> but it's strange for me. It's That's strange. Weird. Yeah. No, that I totally get that. It's okay. Okay, guys. So, gossip, gossip. One thing I first want to say is that I uh, bumped into a friend on the road. Uh, me and my friend had lunch. No, we should. We had dinner, and then we were walking in um, on campus, and we bumped into a friend. And he said, oh, there is this stupid girl. And I was like, oh, what's going on? And then he said, I think she's uh, trying to fool me. And I was like, what do you mean? And he said, yeah, well, she seems like she's just uh, abusing um, Lao Wais, you know, not abusing, how to say that word, like, um, oh, yeah. using, using Lao Wai, foreigners, sorry, yeah, oh, yeah, just using foreigners, because basically what she said was, I want to fuck you, but we need to fuck in the place that's not the dorm, because somebody else is, obviously, there are two people in each room. Um, so if we go to a hotel tonight, will you pay? And then he was like, she's totally using me. And we were like, well, it actually just sounds like she wants to, you know, have sex. But anyway, we were talking a little bit about it, like back and forth. Uh, sadly, he can't go tonight because he has, uh, he doesn't have his passport because, um, all the other guys uh, went to the visa office later than me, so they still didn't receive their passport, so he can't go anyway. But <laughs> it's just quite funny because I was like, I really, I was a little surprised. Like, would a Chinese girl really be that straightforward? Because I usually bump into these really in innocent girls, but of course, China is a big country, so there are many different people here, and this girl, she was definitely very, very straightforward. <laughs> So yeah, we were talking a little bit about that and we said, you know, if she's annoying, just go and find another one because there are a lot of Chinese people here. He likes Chinese girls, so. So yeah, and I also forgot to tell you guys that we got a security guard at the door mm -hmm. and all the girls, even the, even the girls who say they don't like Asian pe uh, guys, they're like, wow, he is pretty shy, he is actually, he, handsome. He is He's, he's a shui girl. he's a handsome brother in Chinese, <laughs> we call them shui girl. <laughs> he's really shy, like when I go there I'm just like hello and show my card, <laughs> remember my name, you know, it's, even our girlfriend who's, tall. yeah, he's tall and he's, and he just looks really good in that uniform, <laughs> he really does, he must have so many like girls coming all day and be like ah. Oh. You know, I wonder if they bring him candy. Maybe we should. Oh, we should bring him candy. That could be so much fun. I'll be like, hey, Schweiger, do you want to taste my uh, Danish candy? Oh my God, he's gonna hate me forever. <laughs> Maybe he'll like it. Yeah, because the Chinese always tell me that it tastes like the Chinese medicine. So. Yes, yes, yes. I, I, I thought. Yeah, that. right. Yeah. yeah. I'm looking up because she's up on the bed on top of you guys. So I hope you're feeling the vibe here. We're just like girls hanging in the dorm room and you guys are like sitting on this chair on the other side, but you can't see her, but she's there. Hi. <laughs> Do you want to say hello, Jasmine? Yes, of course. Okay, I'm just gonna take the camera up here. Hi. Yeah. Hello, everyone. <laughs> this is Jasmine from Thailand. She's my. She's gonna be my roomie for the next two years. So you have to get yeah. to know her now. Yeah. And you have to get used to the camera. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I'm not really used to, to the camera. No. I try. You try. That's yes. a good thing. Well, I think I she's very good. Anyway, guys, we're gonna go now because the camera is very soon out of battery. So we're just gonna say, have a nice day, evening, wherever you guys are. I hope you like my little video for today. It was not crazy, but it was just a normal day in Beijing. We have lots of normal days as well. Beijing is not that as crazy as you think sometimes yeah. because I know my videos are pretty all over the place, but today was just really chill. I hope you guys enjoyed it and have a nice day or evening and see you guys tomorrow. See you and 再见! Bye! 再见! Bye!